Well, as you know, myself and Nick are massive advocates of tech in property, and we were delighted to be asked by Gary here to host the uh, property tech event in London happening on the 14th of October. And Gary's the organizer of the event, so welcome, yes. Gary. Thank you for asking us. Thank um, you for having me. Give us a little bit of an overview of the event. Okay, so the idea for the event is simply to combine the different sectors within property um, with the emerging technology startups um, known as PropTech. So we've got the commercial sector, the traditional residential sector, and then we've also got um, hundreds of uh, PropTech entrepreneurs attending to showcase all the new platforms that they're building, which um, hopefully enhances and improves you know, the current um, products that are already out there. Um, so it's not about tech versus the traditional, it's actually about combining the two and, and uh, hopefully making you know the a better experience yeah that's it exactly mm -hmm. so I that's think that's that's very important what you said that tech isn't there to take over from anything it's there Absolutely, to actually yeah. enhance and make things more efficient yeah. um, and it's a great place it's kind of a melting pot of ideas as well isn't it where people can work together collaborate um, that's very much what the prop tech space is about isn't it absolutely yeah so um, by nature you know it's very collaborative it's very inclusive it's not all about knowledge sharing um, helping each other rather than competing with each other um, so that's very much part of the ethos of the event so um, you know a lot of the discussions that will be happening are between very well established companies like Savills and JLL combining that with you know entrepreneurs and startups that have only been around for a couple of years so it's really about knowledge sharing and, and building networks indeed and I think from the sort of estate and lettings agent point of view to actually adopt some of this technology is going to give them very much a competitive edge and Absolutely. I would urge every lettings and estate agency to send one at least one person along from their office Absolutely. to actually immerse themselves in your day because that's the way to really understand where the sector is going. Yeah absolutely I mean there's um, so many different sectors and, and uh, entrepreneurs doing so many different things that you, you know there's you're bound to learn something um, and like you said I, I can't think of a better way to immerse yourself into what's next yep. you know what's current and, and where the industry is going. Indeed. Well, we're very excited to be part of it, especially that we know that you've managed to secure Brandon Lewis, the housing minister, as a keynote speaker, which is, is great to have him there. And I know he'll be very supportive. What other speakers do you have? Um, so we've got um, quite a wide range of speakers. We've got about 30 plus. So it's a really you know, a lot of speakers for one day. So it's going to be a really packed kind of um, sessions, quite fast paced. Yeah. Um, so we've got people from Savills, we've got um, Yolanda Brown, Yolanda Barnes, pardon me. Uh, we've got Russell Quirk from eMove. Yeah. We've got uh, Robert Elise from Easy Property. Um, we've also got people from uh, JLL, from the retail sector. Uh, we've got um, people like um, Nick Russell from We Are Pop-Up, who will be covering, again, the future of retail and pop-ups. Um, so it's, it's a real mix and a real variety. Uh, and like I said, there's something for, for everyone from across the property sectors. Indeed, and there's great apps uh, and companies there like Fixflow who are already yeah. gaining traction in the sector. Yeah, absolutely. So he's going to be doing a, a special session on stage where essentially he will tell us about all the partnerships that they are um, doing with you know large established estate agents. So you know that's another really good example of how these young tech companies are actually helping the established companies to improve their service offering yep. and yep. ultimately um, improve things for the end customer. I think. Well this is why I think we're so supportive of it because at the end of the day if landlords and lettings agents adopt tech ultimately the people that are really going to benefit are tenants and tenants are really all of our customers and certainly in our world that we exist in um, and anything that improves uh, the experience from consumers has got to be a positive thing. Absolutely I mean that's Again, that's part of the ethos of the event is what is actually going to benefit the end customer more. And as we know, a lot of customers are tending to go on mobile and on yep. going online yep. simply because it's easier for them. That's more convenient for them. So that's how everyone should see it is exactly that. How is it beneficial to the to the end customer? And, and that's what that's kind of the running theme throughout the entire event. Yeah. 
So, well, I think yeah. it's going to be a fantastic day, the 14th of October in London. We're going to put a link underneath this video where you can get your tickets to the event and Property Tribes is offering a 10% discount, yep. which you can apply with the um, discount code that we're going to give you at checkout. But thanks very much for asking oh, us to uh, host the event, Gary. And I think, as you said, it's a really great day for people that really want to grasp and immerse themselves in PropTech and see actually kind of bring the future into their lives now. Absolutely. Yeah, I, I hope we get um, a really wide spectrum of attendees from the estate agent side, from the commercial property yeah. side, um, and the prop tech entrepreneurs themselves. Yeah. So yeah, it'll be a really good day. It will. Really looking forward to it. Thanks very much, Thank Gary. Thank you, Vanessa.